From the Exorcist to that championship season, Jason Miller has always been one of Scranton's favorite and most famous sons. Now all of Lackawanna County has come together to unveil a lasting memorial to the late playwright and actor. Loved ones and friends unveiled the monument featuring a bust of Jason Miller on Scranton's Courthouse Square. Those who knew and respected him huddled against the wet weather in warm remembrance of the Pulitzer Prize winner, whose ashes were incorporated in the memorial. There was never a grave site in uh, Jason's behalf. Um, he um, was cast to the, to the wind, so to speak. Some of them his, is in Ireland. Some of them is at Notre, is at Notre Dame, uh, which he beloved. Uh, some of it is right here, some of it is right here. Dana Oxley is Jason Miller's common-law wife. She took pride in the tribute to the man she loved. I was just pleased that everyone here loved Jason, and he loved everyone. I mean, he was such a good, interesting, kind person. Miller died unexpectedly at his home in Scranton in 2001. The bust of Jason Miller is absolutely magnificent, and what makes it even more remarkable is that it was sculpted by one of his very best friends, actor Paul Sorvino. Most of us experience a championship season. As local songwriter Kevin Campion sang a tribute to Miller, Sorvino contemplated the emotional connection to the sculpture he crafted in memory of his friend. In this case, that he was almost like a almost like a brother of mine and uh, so it's um, it had to be everything I could do and when you're faced with that kind of challenge and it's going to be here forever this is a big deal. A deal fit for a Pulitzer and Tony winner and an Academy Award nominee who was most proud of being a part of his hometown. He could have been anywhere and been a star, but he chose to come here and give back to the people that he knew and loved. So it's great that he's, you know, that people will walk by and see this tribute to him, and I, I hope they, uh, I hope everybody just remembers how great he was. He was just great. Paul Servino is currently putting the finishing touches on his latest movie, The Trouble with Callie, which was shot for the most part in Scranton. He's hoping it'll be ready within the next few months. Kathy Bazinski, timesleader.com.